Wait, like, trading these two knights for that bishop and that rook? I don't even know if that's worth it. The knights were so, so good. All right, but my opponent resigned, so it was worth it. And now we're streaking within one point. Oh, and Sir is lost. Sir is lost to Jantonio1984, my hero, who's actually in third place. Close third. So this will be an intense finish. Okay. Should I keep streaking? I think I will. With this win, would move me into first place, finally over the mighty Sirs. Hit me with an Evans. No, I'm the Gambit Man. Tried to hit me with an Evans. Oh, I could do this, but I think I should just... Actually, is this even the best move? And they take F7. Okay, you know what? You know what? We have a bush gas on the board with b4 included. I was gonna say just bishop d4 with the fork, but okay, he goes knight f7. Yeah, I need the, all the bush gas stuff. I need all my bush gassy juices. Let's go. Let's go. Bush and gas. Let the powers flow through me. Let the powers flow through me. And let you feel their fury of bush and of gas. Here we go. The bush gas gambit with b4. Okay, queen e2. What is this? What is this move? Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna go here. I just want a castle. I just want a castle. I just want my rook in the game. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. But let me just put my rook right there. I mean, there's so many things hanging. So many things I could take. An absolutely insane position. Absolutely insane. Let's play... Let's take it and go our cafe. Queen e2. Queen e2. Yes! <laughs> yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, crazy game. Crazy game, because or else, if I take this queen, my opponent has, like, literally two rooks, a bishop, and a knight for the queen. That's quite the haul. But this was just a bush gas gambit, just with b4 on the board, and b bishop b6. I gotta... This is very interesting, very interesting. Okay, I wonder if bishop g4 was actually good. Oh, I did, I did. I did do this right. Okay, this, this was very playable. But... Maybe white's winning after pawn takes. And rook of eight, and then, I don't know. Maybe they just... Uh, King g1? I don't know, Stockfish is changing its mind, so... It's kind of interesting, but yeah. I don't know, we just, we, we, we just went all out and it worked. Okay, I gotta get back to my arena, I gotta win this. We're first in the arena, let's go. Let's go, let's go. You think bishop d4 is correct? Oh! Einsteinia has checked this line. Bishop d4 in that position. Alright, well, I'm waiting for another game anyway. The Evans Gambit of the Bush Gas Gambit. Okay, wait. Here? What do we got? No, it's plus two and change. I don't know. We'll have to check it later. Okay. Uh, let's go. No Berserks, so I just need to hold my lead. Let's play a Von Papil. And we kept these on. Oh! E5, the Lemberger counter gambit. Oh, baby. The Schneider attack. The counter, counter gambit. The counter, counter gambit. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, wow. I just got two of my favorite lines ever in back-to-back -back games. Bishop c4. Okay, we let both these pawns go. We're two pawns down. Our knight's under attack, but we have this killer mate threat here. How do you defend it? g6, queen d7, queen e7, queen f6. One of them is right. One of them is right, and I won't say it on stream because I don't want to get stream sniped. But Queen D7 was played. Okay. Okay, it's just Knight takes E4. Just grab it. All of them are a little bit different. They're all a little bit different. Knight there. I think it might just be I think it might be Knight H3. What's the move? Because I could go here in g 5 I guess just g 6 In h5, in h5. Okay, well, the reason I went knight h3 is because in this position I want queen e2, not knight f3, which would have blocked it. 
And with knight h3, I mean, I was coming in anyway. Coming in anyway here, threatening now f7. So bishop e7 had to block this. And now knight h6, defending f7, but we got him with the fork! We got him with the fork! Let's go! Oh, we're gonna win this arena. We're going to win this arena. Oh wait, these must stay on, these must stay on. Oh baby. Oh baby, we got him with the fork. Look at look, look how well all the pieces are doing here. Look how well knight g5, hitting f7. I think I've had this exact position before. I think I've literally had this exact position before, but we're hitting f7, knight h6, knight check. We've provoked g6, so there's no control here. We got the pin, everything. Oh, beautiful. Oh, oh yes, yes, yes. Oh, that worked out so great. Let's, let's do a fancy check. Let's do a fancy check in celebration. Yes. Yes, the Schneider attack and the bush gas. Back-to-back -back games. Oh, yes. Oh, baby. To be fair, in this case, I wasn't down more than two pawns. And really, just one pawn. I really do know my gambits, yes. It's always embarrassing if I literally, like invented the line like i created the line and then i don't know my own move right <laughs> that's actually happened a few times before and to be fair the schneider attack i have not checked in months since i made that video because I, I i just don't really get it much also but that's awesome that's awesome and, and i mean the lumber like like it's a good line to know because the lumberger counter gambit i do think is actually quite good like i would recommend it for for people who just don't want to face just general black redeemers or von Popiels. um of playing e5 on their move, but uh, yeah, yeah, so, so I mean, we're talking about this position and playing e5, the Lemberger counter gambit. So if you take it, then queen takes d1, black's doing all right, but okay. Okay, seven, I mean, I mean I'm just up a queen here, but my opponent's playing on, I think. I'm feeling good. I'm so glad that worked. We got him with the fork. We got him with the fork. Check. King's gonna have to move. Queen takes rook. But, oh, Sirs has passed me in the arena. Okay, opponent finally resigned. Sirs, oh, for a second Sirs was at 43. I just jumped to 45 with that win. Oh my god, I still haven't even played Sirs.